Our brains grow quickly, starting before birth and continuing into early childhood. As a child interacts with the world, their experiences, both positive and negative, stimulate the brain, causing it to form neural pathways that lay the foundation for lifelong cognitive and behavioral functioning. A logo for the CDC appears featuring an abstract bird made of human faces in profile. A timeline progresses from individual brain synapses to a fully formed brain. A child is holding a red balloon. The balloon pops and reveals brain synapses forming neural pathways. Different types of stress can affect brain development early in life. These different types of stress are positive stress, tolerable stress, and toxic stress. It's important to note that adversity and stress are not always toxic. If stress responses are brief and buffered by protective factors like safe, stable, nurturing relationships and environments, children can manage that stress successfully and build confidence and resilience. The girl is surrounded by red lightning bolts and yellow circles. A large green bubble protects her. But if adversity is chronic, severe, or excessive, a toxic stress response may trigger biological and behavioral changes that act as risk factors for poor mental, emotional, behavioral, and physical health. The green bubble disappears to reveal neural pathways full of yellow and red dots. Several dots are transformed into black dots with lightning bolts. A blue electric charge flows throughout the new black dots. No matter what kind of stress a child encounters, Stress has the potential to change the biology of their brain and the way it functions. These changes can influence how a child adapts to adversities, meaning negative experiences in both healthy and unhealthy ways. The screen is filled with a path of winding roadways. Red and yellow dots glide along the roadways. A yellow dot encounters a stop sign, hazard cones, and a pothole in the roadway. When we experience stress, the brain triggers the body to produce hormones that activate a stress response called the fight or flight response. In a moment of crisis, this response is necessary, but stress can become toxic when this response is activated frequently or for prolonged periods of time. The brain of a woman appears on screen. Yellow dotted lines extend from the brain throughout the body. The woman appears uncomfortable as she looks around the screen. Toxic stress can alter the architecture of the brain and negatively impact the development of our immune system, stress regulation, and other systems in the body. These biological changes make us more prone to disease, mental health challenges, and behavioral health issues. Children exposed to toxic stress and early adversity may struggle with learning to regulate their emotions. They may have difficulty developing executive functioning a mental skill set critical to success in school and life that includes things like working memory and self-control. A child who has difficulties with executive functioning may have trouble focusing and following directions. Children growing up with toxic stress may have difficulty forming healthy, stable relationships and may adopt unhealthy behaviors to cope. These unhealthy coping behaviors can include smoking, using alcohol or other substances, or engaging in risky sexual behaviors. Click the next button to proceed.